Is it worth getting the venti slash large? Is it worth getting a small with no ice? This is secrets from a restaurant worker. Okay, I'm not gonna say from who, but I got this from the exact same place. Three different sizes, all right? Three different sizes, same drink. We have a small, we have a medium slash grande, and we have a venti. This is also known as a tall for some unknown reason. And just like that, that's how they close it up and give it to you, send you right out the door, okay? Now I wanna show you guys something. Now each cup has these three lines shown, okay? These are not here on purpose. They're measuring tools, actually. Uh, they're measuring, you know, how much espresso, uh, how much, you know, different types of deer they're gonna put in your drink. But it's also meant for ice measuring. They make sure you put it to the very top. That's what they teach in orientation and training. Okay, they make sure that you want to fill the cup halfway more with ice at all times to keep the drink certified fresh, certified cold. Okay, but I'm going to show you our drinks. Doesn't matter if it comes cold or hot. At the end of the day, they're just drinks. So let's see if this fits the small and let's put the case to rest forever. Before I do that, I'm just to show you how expensive these things are. This is $10. Okay, this drink, depending on where you are, might be more in California, but when you're drinking this, okay, you're paying about seven to ten dollars just for a tall, no, it's all a venti drink. See, I got messed up with tall, tall, small, not tall, large. It's complicated, but venti, okay, you're essentially paying more for more drink supposedly, and for you know your grande. Cinco, four to six dollars the average for just a regular medium drink right here. And a small, you go to any coffee shop, a drink will be two dollars, three dollars. So that's what we're gonna put down right here. Depending on your location, like I said, it may vary. Yours might be cheaper. At the end of the day, is it worth it for your value? Let's find out. Oh, it might overfill. Let me know down if you think it's gonna overfill or you think it's gonna be underpoured. Look at that. Last drop. And just to show you how much ice they really put in your drink, that third line, the one on the very top, compared to this third line, that's a whole damn cup. So just keep in mind, next time you're ordering from your favorite coffee shop drink, is your drink more valuable or is it better just 